Hey you guys! The cryptocurrency market has recently been showing maximum volatility and constant changes in sentiment. And while the market is so unstable, we have quite a few opportunities to add promising coins to our portfolios at the most attractive prices. That is why today I will talk about 4 RWA tokens with a small market cap and the potential to grow 20, 30, or maybe even 50 times. You will also find out what the overall potential of this market is, which major players are ready to enter it, and what can be the main catalyst for growth. So be sure to watch this video till the end, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and let's get started. In general, I would like to point out that many investors still do not understand the true potential of this market area. However, it should be understood that this narrative has grown to impossible proportions in the last year and a half alone. Back in August of last year, this market had a total capitalization of just 2.7 billion, and now that number is over 8.3 billion, and this is just the beginning. In fact, many experts predict that by 2030 we will see a market capitalization of up to $3.5 trillion in the worst-case scenario and up to $10 trillion in the best-case scenario. Personally, I find such numbers a little scary, but it is a great indicator that this market can bring the highest possible profits for all of us, because we are still in the relatively early stages. In general, you can see how absolutely all areas of this sector have been growing lately. Here's what the CoinGecko research team has to say about it. The market capitalization of tokenized treasury bonds has increased from $719 million to $144 billion since the beginning of the year. And the most interesting thing is that only six months have passed and we are already seeing an almost twofold increase. At the same time, back in 2023, this market showed an increase of 782%. The market of commodity tokens, especially those related to gold, has also grown. And this is one of the main reasons why very soon all the big funds will come to this market to launch it right into space. And our job is to be at the beginning of that flight so we can just unload our tokens with a bunch of X's at the top. Speaking of funds, BlackRock will be the leader here. In general, this is nothing new. This fund wants to own the whole world, wants to be the biggest one, and they are succeeding. At the beginning of this year, they created the RWA fund BlackRock launched the USD Institutional Digital Liquidity Fund from BlackRock, which means a $100 million investment by BlackRock in the world of tokenized assets through the USDC stablecoin on Ethereum. The fund, which invests in cash, U.S. Treasury bills and repurchase agreements, has raised more than $240 million since its inception. Larry Fink believes that RWA is one of the most promising areas after AI, and the current market is proving that, so he and his fund will be very active in this story. And now that we have talked about some growth indicators, possible catalysts in the form of the arrival of large players in this market, I suggest we move on to the selection itself, because I plan to talk about some of the best representatives of RWA narrative with small cap. Before we move on to the first token, I would like to explain that most of the coins we will talk about are quite risky. After all, their fully diluted market capitalization is much higher than the actual current market capitalization. This perfectly demonstrates to us the fact that not all the supply of the token is on the market and there will be more tokens on the market in the future. So do your own research and be sure to assess all the risks associated with investing in certain assets. Our first RWA project is Swarm Markets the world's first licensed DeFi platform regulated by the German Federal Financial Supervisory Authority. Swarm Markets functions as an AMM-based DEX for Ethereum, targeting institutional and individual investors. The platform supports different types of tokens, including crypto assets and tokenized real assets. In 2021, the project raised $15 million from 250 liquidity providers and launched the first version of DEX on Ethereum. By the way, at the time of recording this video, the project's TVL is $18 million. And despite the fact that the project is quite small, this result is very good. Swarm Markets offers trading in tokens representing a wide range of assets, including stocks, bonds, and commodities. In order to trade, you must undergo KYC verification, as trading in RWA assets is highly regulated. 
The platform also offers corporate accounts for institutions and a permit-free OTC trading service for large transactions. SMT's market capitalization is currently $52 million, but I believe it has the potential to reach $1 billion, which means growth of 20 times or more. What do you think? Write in the comments. RWA's second project is Realio. The Realio network is a software-as-a-service platform that combines advanced blockchain technologies with high-quality investment opportunities. The platform runs on the Ethereum and Arbitrum networks, providing stability for a variety of digital assets. The Realio network is based on four main pillars, fiat and cryptocurrency payments, crypto trading, crypto economic services, and community services. The platform offers features such as a decentralized exchange, a secure wallet, a tokenization engine, a compliance engine, and a smart contract engine. Realio makes investing in real assets, such as real estate or stocks, more accessible through fractional ownership of tokens. The blockchain provides security, transparency, and easy access to liquidity, increasing confidence in investments. Rio currently has a market capitalization of $10 million, with the potential to reach $100, $150 million in a bull market, or 10, 15 times growth. I would like to note here that this token carries more risks than the first token, but this does not negate its growth potential. Our third project is Centrifuge. Its goal is to connect DeFi to real assets, reduce the cost of capital for small and medium-sized businesses, and provide stable sources of income. Centrifuge allows users to generate profits that are not tied to crypto assets and transfers real monetary value from the fiat industry to the crypto sector. Centrifuge provides liquidity for assets such as real estate, invoices, and royalties by linking them to decentralized finance. Procedures are automated through smart contracts, making them more accessible and transparent. The protocol tokenizes real assets, turning them into NFTs that are funded through Tinlake, the first dApp centrifuge to access liquidity on Ethereum. These tokenized assets can be freely transferred and used in the DeFi ecosystem. By the way, the project recently raised a rather large investment round of $15 million. Currently, Centrifuge's market capitalization is $270 million, with the potential to reach $5 or maybe $7 billion in the future, which means 18 to 25 times growth. What do you think about this unique way of tokenization? Share in the comments and are moving on to the last representative of the RWA market. Our last project is Clearpool. It is the world's first decentralized credit marketplace, offering hundreds of millions of loans over DeFi protocols. Clearpool operates on multiple networks, allowing investors to select loan applications for funding. It acts as a bridge between institutional borrowers and lenders, giving lenders full control over borrower selection and risk assessment. Lenders can earn higher interest rates by providing unsecured liquidity to higher risk institutional borrowers. To participate in Clearpool as a borrower or lender, users must own CPool tokens. Borrowers create their own pools of borrowers and financial institutions set interest rates through the Oracle Clearpool network. Lenders can deposit their CPool tokens into a specific pool and earn interest. Clearpool has pioneered crypto lending by creating pools for individual borrowers, where risks are assessed based on borrower profiles and the credit market. The project was launched in early 2022 with three liquidity pools from FBG Capital, Wintermute, and Folkwang. In 2024, Clearpool introduced term pools, credit vaults, a new chain, fintech borrowers, and a new user interface. Clearpool has a market capitalization of $100 million and the potential to reach 5 to 7 billion in a bull market, which means 50 70x growth. I would like to remind you that this video is by no means financial advice. This is just my vision and thoughts on the market, so always do your own research before investing and invest wisely. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the growth of coins. Thanks for watching, your coin post.